Hallo und herzlich willkommen zu einem weiteren Spiel aus der Reihe. Ich muss immer was sortieren. Äh, spiel die Demo. Wir spielen heute die Demo. 130 von Pizza Game. Eine Visual Novel Dating Simulationssatire oder so. So, wir fangen einfach mal direkt mit deinem neuen Spiel an und denken auch gar nicht mehr groß weiter drüber let's nach. Do this. Genau, let's do this. Attention! Pizza Game is a work of fiction. Any references to political, historical or actually are meant as par parodic and do not mean to represent any real people, place, thing or philosophical construct. Do not use pizza. Game as a source when writing an essay or Wikipedia article because you will get an F on it unless the subject is works of art. Uh, schon wieder morning, morning Tim Zeit. Schon wieder morgen. Bah. So, das ist unser geiles Apartment. Mit der Regenbogen. Hmm, I'm kind of in a rush today. Should I still spend time rambling about how to do basic actions in my daily life? Yosh. Using the mouse clicky or the set key, I can advance to the next dialogue or a thingy that happens in my life. For example, Just now I rolled out of bed and punched the alarm clock in the face. Bam! That'll teach ya. Oh my god, inner Kiani. So, wir haben auch noch eine innere, die mit uns redet. OMG girlfriend, quit screen around. Inner me? Es ist 7 Uhr. Warum schreist du so herum? Visual novel is all about to read. But sometimes I do not want to read. Sometimes I want to space out while people are talking to me and contemplate the vast emptiness of my existence. It should... I should use the skip key. Press tab or the fast forward icon in the top bar to forward pass whatever dumb thing people are saying. Or if I'm really pressed for time, pressing uh, or the scene skip icon in the tip bar will forward to the next scene. That's inner me. She's my thought bubble person who says all my thoughts. Except this one. I'm shouty because you You can't afford to be late on your first day. First day? I wonder what she could be talking about. If I click on the big words or press the L key, I bet I can find out more. I will try that now. First day? First day of what? Of your new job, remember? What new job? You know, the one at the big Microsoft fit. Nope. The one you got hired for like a week ago? Not ringing a bell, sorry. Not ringing a bell. Also, die Typos sind echt super übel. It's been your dream to work at there since you were little. Oh yeah, that new job. Uh, ich kann's kaum erwarten. That's right. Just this week I landed my dream job at the big Microsoft Fit. One of the biggest tech companies in world. In, in world. Yay. Hmm. That 
is kind of a weird thing to forget. It probably is not important though. I'm going to be the personal assistant of the CEO, Mr. Arim Nais. It will be like 50 shades of grey, only more sexy. I'm very optimistic about my prospects. I majored in boys in college. So I have all the right experience to be the perfect 1950s secretary type. Is that even legal? Ha! Ah, good one, enemy. As you can see, inner me and regular me, who is me, get in all kinds of We're kind of best friends. No, we are not. Hey, that reminds me, I still have to introduce myself. I'm Kiani. It looks like Ki. Uh, it looks like Kiane. But it is actually pronounced like Cayenne, the pepper, or like Cheyenne, Wa Wyoming, Cheyenne, Wyoming, but without the H and without the Wyoming. Also Cayenne. Okay. I am inter to credit to change Kian's H years old. Hmm, let's see, what else? My hobbies include eating pizza, thinking about cats and reading boy band magazine. My best traits are my prettiness and my very prettiness and my winning sense of humor. Winning what? A particular you a participation award? Right now my goal in life is to find a true love boyfriend. Or girlfriend or any friend really I'm lonely help mostly I'm hoping I'll end up with being dating my boss because he's rich and handsome but we'll just have to see all right all right quit rambling you gotta get in the shower soon or else you will be late work oh crap you're right I always lose track of time hopefully Johnny doesn't need it hey Cayenne hey Cayenne god damn it can I use the shower first -er today ah hey right, Johnny can I use the shower that is Johnny yeah that he doesn't need a tutorial arrow, I can see where he is. What is that? Johnny is my roommate and he sucks. He's always doing dumb stuff like showering and saying hello to me. We share the rent so I gotta put up with it. Though, to be honest, I don't actually know what he does. For a living and mostly he is stupid. Unfortunately, I can complain. Uh, I can complain about him all I want in my help. Full scrapbook. When I see a notification that says the character bio has been updated, it means a character bio has been updated. Pressing X will open and close the in-game menu. I can also press C to go directly to the character screen. That's only for emergencies, so. Weirdly enough, there are already entries in here. I don't remember writing. Go to title screen, quit the game, pause, file and select. Was auch immer. Options. Oh, uh, hier kann man vielleicht sagen, wir öffnen mal, nö, passt schon, ja, passt von der Größe, 
Also wenn ich das ja eh gerade hochskaliert habe, weil es eigentlich hier das Setting von einem anderen Spiel ist. Und Charaktere. Here is looking at you, me. I'm Kiani. Kayen. I'm Kayen. Okay. The prettiest girl in ever. Right now I am working for Mr. A at the big Microsoft. My goals in life are petting lots of cats and getting a boyfriend. Wish me luck, Austrian. Okay. Stay humble, stay happy, Jay. My annoying roommate. His dad owns a huge ice cream company. Johnny's never gotten a cent from it. But he still considers eating only his dad's ice cream brand a get rich quick scheme. I think he's voiced by Anthony Sardinha. Okay. Aram. Oh, can he not read? Aram's my boss and celebrity crush. He's the CEO of the big Microsoft bit. A tech company he founded. Mr. Arim has a hard time warming up to people, but I know he likes me deep down. Plus, I've already decided we're getting married. Ha. Six handsome. Okay, Capricorn. Chris has no idea how to sum up his life on one piece of tape. I met Chris at the cafe place. By my word, he is pretty cute and he is a passion about running off success a successful business. I bet we will be great friends, maybe even something more. Now to sell friend up Chris for free food and kiss. Okay, the other lesen wir dann wenn wir sie treffen. Um, Probably just a friendly scrapbook girl. You know you're talking out loud, right? You know you're talking out loud, right? Oh, there he goes. Messing more things up. If I were really such a bad roommate, could I do this? Johnny and I live in Flordaddle. My relatives like to point out that this is not actually a real place. They are wrong. Floor Daddle is a new state made back when America decided to combine two states, Florida and Seattle, to save money. Cayenne, you're not looking. It's not a very good place, but I have to live here to work at my dream job and I am not sure why Johnny is okay. here. So that was like meant to be a distraction and chills but if you're not looking I just gonna go shower okay I'm the only one I know from my high school who gets to live in a double state dorm. That's pretty cool. Vor allem Florida und Seattle. Die sind ja meisten von am weitesten von uns entfernt. No time for rambles, Cayenne. It's 7.43. You're gonna be late. Oh no, gotta drive to work in a chivy. Looks like I'll just have to shower in the car. Phew, das war knapp. Ich bin froh, dass wir rechtzeitig hier sind. 3 p.m. Just in time. 3 Uhr Nachmittag. I think I'll try saving my progress by writing it down in my notebook just in case. That way I can go do other things like eat a salad and when I come back and everything will still be here. The shortcut key for the save load screen is S. Mm. 
S stands for super very good job progress file menu. Once on that menu I can say blah. You can say that like I'm not going to corrupt your files. Do it bitch and I will kill you. Wait, look out, the receptionist desk is coming. Say what? Hmm. Ich schätze mal, das ist der Rezeptionist. Ich sag mal hallo. Hallo. Ja, passt, Office und so weiter. Hallo. I don't she's sitting at a real desk. Ich denke nicht, dass sie an einem echten Tisch sitzt. She's wearing a desk around her like a peanut person. Damn, check out this piece of work. How old do you think she is? 190? What a hag baggedy. Hedgedy badgedy. Oh Sometimes I think you exaggerate a little bit. Do you have an appointment or one? Ooh, I'm Cayenne. And I'm here to work for Mr. Arimanes. Is that good enough? That's definitely gonna be good enough. Hmm, no. Warum nicht? You say your name is Cayenne. Yes, it's pronounced like the pepper. I don't see that name on the list. Well, have you tried looking under pronounced like the pepper? Trust me, it's not there. And if your name ain't on the list, then your story doesn't check out. Well, that's no problem. You can just write it in. As if we have procedures around here, young lady. They are designed for security reasons. You should leave right now, or else I think we're gonna have a problem. What? Why? Because if you're not on the list and pretending to be, it must mean you're a spy from Linux. Uh, security! Eeks! If I don't say something in my defense, she'll think I'm a spy and my entire career will be over. This will be a great time to make a choice decision to influence the outcome of events around me. I can click any one of the pre uh, predetermined cho choices in order to exert my free will upon others. Sometimes saying the right words at the right time will influence the way things happen to my benefit. I'm going to tell her I'm not a spy using words in the English language. But you don't speak English. I will pick the option that says I'm not a spy. Yay! I know what English means. That was a close call. Hmm. Not that many spies have such a mastery over the English language. But if you're really an employee here, I'm going to need to see your employee passcode. Well, I guess I'm unemployed now. It's your personal number they give to all employees. You need it to get around the building and past me. Mm. Can I answer a security question instead? My first pet name was Fern. It was a mystery snail. My mother maiden's name... That's not how this works. I am pretty sure your passcode was that five digit number on your acceptance letter. You have that with you, right? Ooh. <coughs> yes, in spirit. What happened to your letter, Karen? It's n das ist nicht mein Fehler. I left it in the fridge to keep it safe, but then stupid Johnny ate it. You're a dumbbell. Yeah, yeah, was auch immer. I don't know what your problem is, young lady. You could have very well asked for an employee form if you wanted a job. But now you can't because I hate you. 
go get your life together outside. This is so embarrassing. Good thing I can just delete my file and while it's this fiasco on the record. If I go to the file menu and click on the top corner of my last favorite file, it will die. Hm. You must be the newbie. Oh my, that sounds like the boss. I'm the boss. Mr. Ari, Mr. Do you know this poop scallion? Yes. She is the new recruit who is just starting today. Really? Yes, really. Never question me again. Mr. Arimnes whispers punch to office lady. My apology, Miss um, Cayenne, pronounced like the pepper. Okay. Let me just get your paperwork sorted out here. But I've kind of been thinking of changing it lately. I figure if I can change my name, I can change anything, like maybe start exercising. Yeah, sicher. Inner me getting real tired of your negativity. Okay, I've added you to the list. Apologies again for not recognizing you sooner. Of course, none of this would be a problem if people kept me informed of anything these days. But oh well, I suppose I'll take the blame for everything once again. So you're the real Mr. Arimnes? Yes, I am. Or at last, I'm what's left of him. <laughs> ah. It's such an honor finally get meet you after <laughs> all our correspondence. Yes, well, that wasn't me. Nancy handles the paperwork. <sighs> Which include responding to fan letters. I like to think I capture your personality to a T, sir. We should let's take a photograph to commemorate our first day working together. I bought a new disposable camera using my life savings so I could capture memories to all my ah, friends. Sometimes taking a picture of someone at the right moment will trigger the thingy to a thingy to happen. Pressing the photo button at the top part of the screen part will activate the camera and save a screenshot as well. Not yet, but I'm done giving the tutorial. Jesus Christ. Um, get this arrow off me. Oh, sorry, Mr. Arimnes. Don't let it happen again. I have half a mind to sue you for assault. The keyboard shortcut to take a picture is F12. Das ist eine blöde Idee, weil das mein OBS ist. But if I don't want any garbage on my computer and just want to try getting a reaction with my in-game camera, I can press F11 instead. Does it make sense? I'm bad at game design. Okay, I'm ready. Take a picture of all of us. You took a pretend photo. Okay, I will press the photo button now. Jeez. Well, not right now. You need to do it a second <laughs> ago. What? But I wasn't prepared. And promise tomorrow. Was auch immer das heißen soll. Ha! No, but seriously, you don't have the right to my image. And if I'm blink in that photo, I will sue you to the moon. Just because today is your first day doesn't mean I'll go easy on you. 
I am the president CEO man around here, so you will do exactly as I say in the name. Oh, I'm not little. My mom said that everybody's eyeball are just born the wrong way, so I appear short to the untrained spectator. In order to successfully integrate with this company, you need to learn the company rules, blah blah, stakeholders, blah blah, corporate policy, blah blah, corpses. Wow, Mr. Arimnesis is saying a lot of words which are boring. When he's done talking, I will say my words back at him. It's important I start building relationships in my new town. In order to do that, I have to raise their affinity. The more affinity I raise, the better my relationship with a dateable person will turn out. How do I raise affinity? If there's one thing I've learned in life, it's that you should always pick whichever option the other person will like the most. Genau, authentisch zu sein und ehrlich und offen und richtig und äh, jemanden zu suchen, der zu einem passt, das ist auch überhaupt nicht wichtig. Weißt du? Wie ein Psychopath. These people's lives mean nothing to me. Das Leben dieser Leute bedeutet mir nichts. Ups. That is not what I meant to say. Das wollte ich gar nicht sagen. What I meant to say was... To get somebody to like you, you should say sexy words at them. Which is why nobody is allowed in the basement anymore. Do you get all that? I should try it now. Sexy, here I come. Did you know that sometimes cat eat it? And that's another thing, your attire is unacceptable. Dude, you can't just interrupt someone's fuck fact. Mm. You look ridiculous, you cannot come dressed to work today like that in my company. Dressed like what? Wait a minute. <laughs> Oh, verdammt, ich habe vergessen, normale Klamotten anzuziehen. Äh, und ich habe immer noch meine Pyjamas an. Warte mal, Kiana sollte das sagen. Okay, wer hat das jetzt gesagt? I can't believe it. I, am em I embarrass myself in front of my celebrity idol. And I've only knew him for like five seconds this is like a dream come true only it's a nightmare hey, consider yourself lucky my stress dreams are filled with toilets i'm so embarrassed mm. yes this is a tragedy for just about everyone especially me And Nancy, who thinks she still needs to be here for some reason. Punch. I just can't believe they cut the annual bonus I used to get for putting up with the garbage proletariat. Oh wait, I'm the boss. I'm putting the bonus back in. We'll just have to cut out both youths your salaries. <sighs> This is the worst day of my life. I'm leaving. Ah! Ah! Cry. Heul, heul, heul. Du, das wäre, hätte doch besser klappen können. Sorry, Enemy. But I couldn't uh, stay there any moment longer. I couldn't let Mr. Arimnais see me cry like this. I really wanted to impress everyone at my first day at of work. And now, I messed it all up. Nun, ist schon sein Fehler. If you had gotten the chance to finish saying your bug fact, 
he would have been too seduced to even notice your shitty clothes. Well, howdy, stranger. Sorry, dass Entschuldigung, dass du warten musstest. Herzlich willkommen. Ja, danke. Wieso dieses lange Gesicht? Och, nichts. Ich hab's nur heute total versaut vor auf Arbeit vor meinem Boss. Ach, das klingt ja schrecklich. Äh, weißt du, was mich immer, immer aufheitert, ist, ähm, Währung gegen Essen zu tauschen. Was kann ich dir besorgen? Ah, schöner Segway, du Idiot. Ich schätze mal, ich werde einfach ein Wasser nehmen. Great. Super. Klingt großartig. Und natürlich nur für deine Information. Das ist eine... Äh, nur eine Randbemerkung. Eine lustige Information. Ähm ich habe es zu einer Policy gemacht dass ich äh, meine Kunden darüber informiere, äh, wie Geschäfts Geschäftskundeninteraktion in einem kapitalistischen Wirtschaft funktioniert. Ähm, the customer pays money in the agreed upon amount upon successful receipt of the agreed upon beverage. Also, der Kunde zahlt das vereinbarte Geld nach erfolgreichem Erhalt der vereinbarten Getränke. Vergiss nicht, das am Ende deiner Interaktion zu machen. With that out of the way, I can go prepare your soda. Jetzt, wo das geklärt ist, kann ich dir deine Soda vorbereiten. Komm gleich wieder. Okay, danke. Erde an Cayenne? Du hast kein Geld. Oh, das stimmt. Und du kannst dich einfach kein Geld zahlen. Das ist illegal. Und wenn du im Gefängnis bist, wie willst du, Mr. Ari Ernes, deine coolen äh, Fehlerfakten erzählen? Das ist ein sehr guter Punkt. Äh, in der Re ich. Sometimes I will need to use real world cash to solve the problem I encounter. Aha. Luckily, I can just insert my credit card into the computer, intro microtransaction my regular dollars into pizza dollars. Klar. Das war ein Witz. Ich bin arm. Help. What should I do? I don't wanna go to jail. Don't worry, girlfriend. I already have a plan though. Uh, thought up. Really? What is it? Okay, here it is. Uh, sell for a time until I come up with a plan. That's not a plan. What am I supposed to do? I don't know, just use your feminine charming. What is that supposed to mean? He's a boy, just remind him of your natural resources and he will be total and he will be totally distracted. Here he comes, go for it. Hey, want to hear a fun fact? Hey, was 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 Uh, ich hab Titten. If you see an expiration date on a bottle of water, it's for is for the bottle, not for the water. Fun fact. Okay, I will go make a drink for you now. Okay, ich werde jetzt deinen Trink machen. Don't have too much fun while I'm gone. Hab nicht zu viel Spaß, solange ich weg bin. Oh. 
Auf keinen Fall. What a dumb fun fact. It wasn't even about bugs. Did you see that? He ignored me. I can't believe it. No boy ever been able to resist the boob trick before. That's okay. In the time it took for him to say his dumb fun fact, I managed to come up with a much better plan. Okay, what is it? The plan is, don't pay for your drink. Oh yeah, thanks. I already got that far. What's the plan for it uh, if we become under arrest? I'm still working out the kings, okay? Oh no, he's back. What is he's doing? I can't see out this thing. He's just staring at me. He's trying to intimidate you. Ma'am, don't let him stand you down. We didn't have three waves of feminism and suffragettes just for this guy to win at you staring, uh, win at a staring contest. <coughs> Look, Jigsaw is up for us, enemy. Maybe, maybe we should just turn ourselves in. No way, just keep your cool girlfriend, ma'am. Don't worry, keeping it cool is just one of my many talents. I am very cool. Here it goes, nothing. I'm very sorry, ma'am, but it appears we are out of soda. Would you like to try our special happy Sino instead? It is four or five dollars. Gargles. Haha, uh -huh, okay. Honestly, Cayenne, maybe you should be the thorough bubble and I should be the front person. That, ah, uh, the thought bubble, okay. That was close. I'm on thin ice here. Hey, you've got him on the defensive. Why not try buttering up with a friend to pal nickname? That way he will think we are friends and accidentally give us money instead of take it away from us. Na klar, das funktioniert immer. What kind of nickname? Something natural and friendly sounding, but also cute to show you are a pretty girl. Let's see. Okay. This is it. I can't feel it. From now on my choices are going to make a big difference. What sort of nickname should I use? Something cool, something not written, Horatio. Quick, here he comes! Here's your happy Sino, ma'am. A very good choice in my humble opinion. I am biased. This is our most, most popular drink option. Even more popular than Starbucks coffee. It said so in it said so in the local newspaper. I am proud. Okay, time to use my nickname. You know the secret ingredient to every drink is friendship. Also fried chicken. Oops. Well I guess now that I told you about what the secret ingredient is, it's no secret anymore. We are bankrupt now. That is a funny joke, huh? Horatio. Oh no, I blew it. Hehe. <laughs> My name is Chris. It's not Horatio. But that is okay, because I love Charles Dickens books. Great, ich auch. Horatio is my favorite character in Atlas Shrugged. What is your favorite book? Stranger. Strangler. It's easy, my, <laughs> my autobiography. You have an autobiography? No, I haven't written it yet. But when I do, it'll be great. In fact, I should probably uh, go do some exciting things to put it in right now. Yeah, like drink coffee. Or leave your restaurant. 
Hey, wait a minute. Phew. Das war knapp. Pack whatever weird language you have up there in a me because we are need to go to run to Canada. Calm down, du, du, komm runter, du Dummheit. Aber alles, was wir machen müssen, ist unseren weiblichen Charme auf diesen Typ anwenden. Er ist wahrscheinlich nicht wirklich weiser. I mean, look at him. He is probably the type who irons his clothing before big date or something. I mean, comes on seriously. Not that I would know because he didn't big date me. You sure you don't think he noticed? Even if he did. What are you gonna do? Call the cops? Hmm. Vielleicht hast du recht. So I guess, since I left work, I have the whole day off now. Yeah. So funktioniert das. Who does? Psh. You s would say verbs and nouns in a sentence, Dora. Boo. Hab ich dich erschreckt? Psch. Ich erschrecke sogar mich selber manchmal. Mach dir keine Sorgen. Niemand äh, kann diese dunkle, verdrehte Coolheit ähm, ertragen oder mit ihr umgehen. Da es welche von der verdrehten Lampe ausgeht. What kind of name is Mom's Lamp? Barb Lamp. Yeah, I know, but I typoed and I didn't bother to fix it. And Warp's Lamp is incredible is an incredible cool name. Naja, nicht wirklich. Macht noch nicht mal Sinn. Well, have you considered the following? Uh, well, nun dann bedenk doch mal folgendes. Du bist scheiße. Hm, das ist ein ziemlich guter Punkt. Auf welcher Seite bist du eigentlich? So yeah, I think we can all agree, Warm Lamp ranks within the top 5 percentile of cool names. Nun, wir können auf jeden Fall, wir können uns auf jeden Fall einig sein, dass wir ja, bla. So. Außerdem ist mein Name. Ist das mein Name? De, die Lampe ist halt Teil von meinem Nachnamen. Und Surname. Ja, ja, genau. Und der Warpteil, der ist mein Titel. It's why they call me the Master of Twisted. Das ist der Grund, warum sie mich der Meister des Verdrehten nennen. A lamp's voice acting clip sounds like a McDonald's drive through Well, hold on. What did you just say? Warte mal, was hast du gerade nur gesagt? Ich habe einfach Master of Twisted gesagt. Yeah, but why does it sound like your voice is coming out of a drive through action figure? Psh, excuse you. I never go out in public without a trusty guitar amp on my vocal cord. It's to emphasize how cool I am. Wow, that was the ugliest sound I've ever heard. Maybe I'll go to the options menu and adjust volume setting to shut this person up. I can press D to quickly go to the options menu.
I can also mute all the sounds fastly by pressing the M key. Sometimes I kill ants using the megaphone. Wow, you're still talking, huh? Wait, no, a magnifying glass. Yeah, that's it. Anyway, you can call me Lamb, regular. Because, I mean, if you have to think about the Twister part too much, that is the part that comes at the end of my name, um, you will probably go insane. It's a well-known brawl that'll fact and tourist attraction. Used to be thousands of people would usually used to be thousands of people would come to see my twisted mind, but after too many accidents, they had to shut it down. Anyway, do you want to go on a date with me, dork? Uh, it? Ooh, hold the horse phone, girlfriend. This is our chance to turn your crappy day around. Sorry, I don't date household objects on principle. Yeah, but live a little. What should I say? Yeah, come on, what's the name of my mate? Well, since you presented such a good case for yourself, I have nothing better to do. Okay, let us smooch. Trick. Nice try wanting to date me and all, but it turns out it was just a prank. Um, why are you rejecting me if you were the one to ask? Oh, uh, it's not. Like it's legally binding or whatever. Psh. What if it is? Um, okay, you are going to keep whining about it. I guess we might as well go on a date. Just to settle this out, of course. And not for other not ironic purposes. Psh. No thanks. I don't really feel like it anymore. I mean, psh. yeah, me neither. Okay then, now it seems like a good time to learn about throwing people in the trash. It is very easy, I just have to click and drag and throw them uh, on the closest tra trash bin. I can also use the L key to insta trash people if I don't feel like doing a click and drag part. Then I have to wait until Thursday for garbage pickup. If Thursday is too long to wait, I can also disable QTEs from the option menus. Take out the trash, click and drag or press L. Well, that solved that problem. <sighs> Another missed opportunity. Well, we didn't want to date lamp anyway. Speak for yourself, girl. Existent is all one required traits for dating. It's just been one thing after the other today. I need William some mama advice. I don't know William kind of creeps me out. Let's go to William some mom's house. This is an LA. That's because William Samam is homeless. William is the boy next door. He's not really the boy next door, but he do live next to our apartment complex in a box. So that's kind. That 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 counts sort of. William Sama and I are great friends. I always come to him for advice. William Sama, say this part shouty. Are you home? Maybe he died. That's okay, we'll come back later. 
I already feel a little better just thinking about getting a chance to feel better. Johnny, I'm home. Hug Johnny. Pay the rent. Nah. Hey Cayenne, how was work? Oh Johnny, I forgot, you lived here. I hope you don't mind, I threw out all your regular spoons and put the plastic ones in a dishwasher. Because plastic doesn't rust and I guess what I learned to do in a shower. Spoons. Yeah, that's real nice Johnny. Hey, you seem kind of down. What's wrong, Kaya? Would work not all you dreamed it would be? Maybe you finally learned that capitalism is what the man wants you to be. Should never have gotten a job, Kaya. Like I said, gotta take a page out of Johnny's book. Johnny doesn't believe in capitalism. He is always looking for alternative means of making money. Which is fine, but like the rent and stuff. Johnny, you just stay home all day doing whatever it is you do and getting stoned on ice cream. You say that like I don't do important stuff, when in fact I'm working very hard to learn the balance a spoon on my nose. Someday, I will be a famous magician. It's my big character trait. I've just decided. He literally just decided. <laughs> Ice cream isn't even a drug. Hi, how do you get high off from it? Asking for a friend. You probably just misinterpreted the name Fake Alaska. It's good ice cream, my dude. You don't even make sense, Johnny. Fine, keep your secrets if you want, I don't care. Anyway, work was fine. I just happened to mess up a major league basketball. What? Why? What the fuck did you do? I went to work and Mr. Airman pointed out I was still in my pajamas. And you know what, Johnny? And you know what, Johnny? It's all your fault. You were the one who, who, who wanted to pass this morning and that messed me up so I didn't have my clothes on for work. Admittedly, your career plan shouldn't have been predicated on taking a shower this morning. I'm lucky I even got to meet Mr. Ari. Ari nice. That lady at the front office says was so rude she wouldn't even let me buy with my employee passcode. <laughs> You're so stupid, Johnny. I hate you and I wish this apartment had never been born. <laughs> I don't have to stand here and listen to that. I'm going to bed. <laughs> Fine. I am sleeping. Oh, sorry. Come on, enemy, let's get out of here. But where should we go? We already went all to all three places I can think of. Hey, I saw in a newspaper at Will's place that there was a new driving class school at the community center. It's now a clock. Okay. It is at now a clock. I don't think you need drivers, Ed. If you own a car. Come on, enemy. Haven't you always wanted to go get my bachelor degree? But let's go. I'm at school now. Okay, ich denke, das reicht. Ich denke, das reicht. Ich habe gedacht, dieses Ding wäre vielleicht ein bisschen lustig. Um, wenn ihr es lustig findet und aufgedreht und wie auch immer, dann gerne weiter. Es ist die gleiche Krankheit, wie es immer ist bei Visual Novels. 
Zu viel Gelaber, zu wenig Interaktion. Dinge passieren einfach so und ähm, man hat selber kaum Auswirkungen darauf. Insofern bedanke ich mich an dieser Stelle für die Aufmerksamkeit. Ich wünsche euch eine tolle Zeit ähm, und ich schau mal, was wir dann als nächstes zocken. Bis dahin, Cheerio mit Au und so.